Morning girls, how we doing? Welcome back to the Time Tato Show. This is Welcome to Vlogmas. Oh, I'm so excited. I love me a Vlogmas. Didn't get one last year. Didn't really even react to the one the year before. But I, I, do, I just do love me a Vlogmas. So this is Vlogmas 2017. It's the 1st of December 2017. I'm so, so incredibly excited for it, guys. They are so festive looking here. Look at them. They look so happy. I'm so excited. Like, let's go! Or, or not. You look or not. A reindeer. Honor. So tall. Why are you whispering? Of course, she looks like a reindeer. She's wearing fucking antlers. Well, you can't really even see them. Hey, guys. Hey guys. You're on Jesus. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. What? That was the most cinematic she has ever been. And it kind of came out of nowhere and was kind of also annoying. Her audio levels are so all over the place because, like, the whole, like, them originally talking was really low. And then suddenly it just peaked. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a bad one to fucking balance. Welcome, welcome, welcome Hello. to the Christmas tag. Merry Christmas. Christmas tag. Woo. Beck, speak up. Are you an ambulance? Yeah. Are you, <laughs> are you a wambulance? Because <laughs> you fucking cry all the time. Amber Lance. Yeah. Oh, alert. She got her. So... Yeah. So, well, you guys, guess what we're doing? Being annoying. I'm gonna, gonna fucking go out and live and say that. Vlogmas. Well, you guys yep. are very thrilled. I'm very thrilled. I'm actually. Vlogmas was my second guess, by the way, guys. Really excited. I was looking over these questions. I'm like, you know, yeah, yeah, I gotta answer for that. Oh, no. Cool. I haven't even. Oh my god, please, dear God. I thought we were done with the girlfriend fucking challenges and quizzes and questions. Oh my fuck. I thought it's been like, I don't even know how many videos. How many videos has it been? Two? <laughs> Do we count the ASMR magazine flipping? Do we count that? I'm gonna count that. That's three, that four actually, you know, because we did a Snapchat Q&A, which is also Q&A. So if since the last Q&A, it's been three videos. I looked at them. So we are doing Vlogmas. Well, okay. I'm doing Vlogmas. She's just gonna be a part of a lot of it. Vlogmas this year is gonna be a bit different. I'm not gonna be vlogging every day because my life kind of... Beck's hair looks very different. Maybe it's because she's not like wearing a hat for once, but I actually kind of like, she said she didn't like the hair. I quite like the hair. Boring. You don't, you don't okay. Like Boring. Yeah. <laughs> you don't go places oh, do, every day. Exactly. And that's tiring anyway. So I don't oh, want to bore everybody. Should. So we're gonna be doing. But you don't need to go out every day to do vlogmas. This is the thing that Amber seems to misunderstand with her modern day content. She doesn't need to go out every day. We're not asking for her to go out every single vlog. We're asking her just to do something, <laughs> anything that might be a little bit interesting, as opposed to. Discussing her hair, discussing her earrings, or I don't know, eating. <laughs> I guess really that is all Amber's life is. Random videos. There are some that's taking quite a bit of planning, and I hope Ooh, you guys exciting. enjoy this year's Vlogmas. December yeah, first, Christmas. Yes. Uh. Get Back it. hits up. I will. Okay, so there is twenty questions, so we need to get a move oh, on. What is your favorite? My Christ, really? How about we do this? I'll make you. How about you do twenty-five questions, but you do them one a day. I don't have to sit here and listen to 20 questions in a fucking row. Christmas movie. I think my favorite, favorite Christmas movie. I'm going to answer along with them because no one asked me to, but I'm going to fucking do it. Favorite Christmas movie. If we're going to go with like any form of Christmas movie, I'm going to say Die Hard. Everyone's already angry as I hear the comments coming. Die Hard is my favorite overall Christmas movie. If you're just going for like specific Christmas movie, I do love me a Home Alone. I do love me a Home Alone. Home Alone is very good. Or a Muppet's Christmas Carol. Fucking come for me if you want. Muppet's Christmas Carol is the best version of the Christmas Carol. My favorite Christmas movie is Elf. Mine. Pretty good. Is either Elf oh, yeah. or. You like Will Farrell. Uh, Santa Claus is coming to town. Santa what the fuck is Santa Claus is coming to town? Isn't that a song? Is that a movie? Is that. Maybe the Santa Claus with Tim Allen? That's a pretty good one as well. Oh, the Christmas Chronicles with Kurt Russell. Quite like that one. That's pretty good. But I also do like Kurt Russell a lot. Santa Claus is coming to town, so you better be nice, y'all. Y'all. Are you on the naughty list or the nice list? Does Santa have any strong opinions? Oh, fat. Santa's fat. Oh, fuck. I definitely on the naughty list because you consider me a fat phobe. <laughs> Santa. I'm sorry. God. Santa. It's it's okay. I, I like I like you. I don't know. Santa, you aren't even fat. I consider you a wee bit chunky. You're just a wee bit chunky. I'm gonna say I am probably on the nice list. Okay, I'm not. Anyway, I'm not. No. Oh. I'm probably on the naughty list. I'm gonna be honest. Why? Naughty girl. Well, I mean, I'm not always nice. Uh, I was about to say, if if this turns into another sex thing, I will genuinely shit my hands and clap. 
Because I don't want to always be nice. So True. Look, but I can't angry be back. Nice. Number three is show us an embarrassing Christmas photo. I don't have one. Embarrassing Christmas photo? Do I have one? I have one where I got like a Superman onesie and I was posing in my Superman onesie well, at Christmas dinner. Like I, I think that's somewhat embarrassing. So yeah, Superman, you're not going to see it, but I did it. I do, but I'm not exactly sure exactly in this moment where it's at. Okay, well, what, what is in that photo? Well, that was exciting. Okay, it is me and my cousin, Kayla. Okay. And she is really mad at me over something. I can't remember what it was. Fantastic. You, all you see is the back of my head. But you see her reaction to me, and she is pissed. You probably opened one of her gifts. She's pissed. That's kind of that cool, it? though. That's oh. kind of one of those pictures that, like, you can make up your own story. Okay. I was, I was doing what I was hoping for, like... Pretty much anything that was more exciting than that, but I guess this is what we got. Before, like, why is she mad at Becky? <laughs> I wonder if this is the time I accidentally told her she was getting a um, DVD VCR combo because this was, you know, um, I want to say ninety nine. What the fuck was that? Ninety eight, ninety nine, somewhere in there. Okay, could have well, been. Whenever that sense. era was getting big, so you know, DVD. Nobody. I've never heard of a DVD VCR combo, but okay. Really Pop off. Been. Have you ever had a white Christmas? I have not. Have I? No. I don't think so. We don't really snow that often. Generally, if we snow, it's like January, February. Really? Really? Okay, I'm going to tell you something. Climate change is real. I'm going to be all Leonardo DiCaprio about Thanks, climate back. change is oh, real. Oh, my Lantis. And in in Kentucky, back in the 90s, we had white Christmas every single year. It okay. Really? Every single year. Fantastic. Until the 2000s hit. And um, if it snowed... Leonardo DiCaprio ruined it all. Obviously, because he made the climate warmer, because he froze to death in Titanic, and he was like, well, I'm never going to let that happen in my real life, so I'm going to make everything warmer. <laughs> this Christmas, we wouldn't be able to drive in it. No, probably not. So it's well, kind of like bittersweet. It's like fantastic. you want that white Christmas, but then it's like, I, I get scared driving in the snow, let's be real. You get scared fucking at anything, honest to God. I'm, is there anything you're not scared of? I'm amazed you're okay wearing a Santa thing in case you think, like, I don't know, Santa's going to fucking fall off and choke you. Yeah, but I mean, you know, people up in, you know, Michigan and Canada and up there, they're just like, she got I know. Oh, Fantastic. I know. But we yes. get a flight down here and everybody's like, How about we've got fucking 17 more questions to go. How about we get on to one of them? Starts freaking out. <laughs> we got to go get that milk and bread and eggs, you guys. I really just want to know what are people going to do with that milk and bread and eggs when the electricity goes out. See, I'm not used to I, I don't know. Have fucking bread and some milk. I don't fucking know. Maybe eat a raw egg. You don't know. They could be a bodybuilder. <laughs> That's my thing. I'm just not used to it. Also, you can cook an egg on a fire. <laughs> like, you can toast toast on a fire. Yeah, Kelly. Kelly. Florida. Florida. Yeah. Do you start your Christmas shopping on Black Friday or wait until the last minute? Um, I, I, it really depends. Like, you did really early. If you see something, you're like, ah, that. I'm going to get that because someone I know really wants that. And I might sell it. So it can start any time of the year. I started it before Black Friday, honey. I started it before Halloween. And I got it all done, all did. I'm sitting here chilling, Fantastic. watching everyone else scramble. Well, that's because you're a shopaholic, and most of those gifts are probably for yourself. <laughs> All right. Um, I come from a family who believes in doing Christmas. Beck, I love you. How about we get these stories, we shorten them down more than a little, less than a lot. I don't need the backstory. Things after Thanksgiving. But my sister put the tree up before Thanksgiving this year, which was, you know, Fantastic. a little strange. Kind of weird, yeah. First of December. Family, you know, traditional holidays. But I like to do my shopping... The beginning. Amber put up her fucking Christmas decorations before Thanksgiving, didn't she? Because I think I started that on like the staff of November or something like that. In December is whenever it usually goes down for me. Okay, since we did it differently this year, do you feel like it's less stressful? Yeah. If you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? Uh, die Hard. <laughs> I'd be I'd be Die Hard as well. I would be Ellis. <laughs> I would be specifically Ellis, mainly for the cocaine. Probably Elf, just because it's my favorite. Yeah, mm -hmm. what makes sense? I've always wanted to be in Home Alone. Okay. I mean, that would be really scary, but... Would you be the wet bandit? <laughs> would you be one of the wet bandits, or would you be the dude at the end with the shovel? Uh, it'd be fun. Scary and fun. Are you going to specify? Alone. I just bought the five Home Alone movies, and I've never seen any of them, so... I'm There's five Home Alone movies? Home Alone 1, Home Alone New York, Home Alone 3 with the pirate and Scarlett Johansson. Is there more than three Home Alone movies? What the... F Why is there five? I can name three. I'm kind of excited. Or, ooh, ooh, ooh. Santa Claus. Whenever your dad Which becomes one? Santa Claus and you get to go up to the oh, North Pole. Okay, okay, that's one. Cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Name all of Santa's reindeers. No. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. <laughs> nope, wrong. Had a very shiny nose. You're, you're starting out wrong. 
Well, are we are, are we doing the fucking chronological order? Which one's at the back? Is Comet at the back? Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen, Prancer, Dancer, Cupid, Vixen, Rudolph? Are we going for? The, is that it? I don't know. Okay, Vixen and Dixon no, no, and Pluto. And Pluto? Oh, yeah, there is. No, there is a, a Pluto reindeer. Nope. There's not a fucking Pluto reindeer. That's a dog from Disney. Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Vixen. I got think I'm most of those wrong. Comet <laughs> and Cupid and Donner and Blitzen. But do you recall the most famous reindeer of all? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I'm going to say, because I don't even remember what I said anymore. I'm pretty sure I got most of them wrong. And I already admit that. So none of you can come for me in the comment section. I think that's how this works in girl world. You had, had a very shiny nose. Oh. Like a light bulb. And, and if, if you, you ever, ever saw it. it you would even say it close. That it feels weird doing this when this isn't actually Christmas time. It just feels like, I don't know, like, here at Christmas Carol, and you're sitting there, and it's like February, you're like, huh? That's what I'm supposed to say. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was like. <laughs> Fantastic. No. We got a lot when more questions. When does your family put up your Christmas tree, and who decorates it? So for me. First of December, and all of us. I ain't got no family. So oh. <laughs> I prefer, if it's Jesus. up to me, and my little family of four, me and Everything's my fur babies, I like to put it up. November 1st, midnight, clock it. Are you for real? November 1st? Did she mean December 1st? Maybe you know that. That's terrifying. Why In November? House of, you know, the International House of Gays. Is she? Gays, me, Eric, and Ricky. <laughs> I quite like that, ma'am. Okay. Is it, so like for her, it's like the nightmare before Christmas. The second Halloween's over, we're down to Christmas time. We like to do it after Thanksgiving, the same as my family. First of December. Like, thing. like I don't have family, I don't have any traditions. Oh my God, go shut up. Like, whoever I'm with, That's, that sounds really sad. Oh, maybe we can compromise and maybe meet in the middle of like, you know, the week before Thanksgiving. It's not after Thanksgiving. When are we filming this? Is, this is the first of December this came up. When the fuck's Thanksgiving? Thanksgiving's fine with me. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not petty. This video came out in the first of December. Thanksgiving is like sometime in November, I think. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? It's fake. Uh, fake, yeah. Peeking at gifts or be surprised. Be Definitely surprised. be surprised. Be surprised, surprised always. Out of it. Exactly. Show us your ugly Christmas sweater if you have one. Actually. I um, I, I don't want to. Okay, guys, I'm not actually like addicted to Die Hard, but I do have the ho, ho, ho. Now I have a machine gun. I do have that. That is one of my Christmas sweaters. I have several. I have a snowman and I also have a reindeer that has like tinsel and lights in its like antlers and you can light them up by pressing its nose. I don't have one. We need to get one. I'm if a you could Christmas guy. With anyone, who would it be? Uh, well, based on all of my other answers, I'm gonna have to say it's <laughs> apparently John McLean says everything else is be Die Hard related. So me and Bruce Willis were smooching. Wow. Can you shoot me? That's so cute. <laughs> That's also Die Hard related. <laughs> it would be Miley Cyrus. Um, I'm just kidding. Okay, it'll be Kate Winslet. Uh, she's dying on the inside. Fantastic. I love you, I love you too. Uh, I, don't I am dying though. Aren't we all? Does your family have a special holiday recipe? You I was like, should I, should I, should I come with them that? Should I make a cholesterol joke? And I was like, no, it's Christmas time. Good season of goodwill. I'm going to be nice now. Like to help make any. I didn't hear okay. that. Sorry. Does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make? I'm I make some fucking good ass mashed potatoes. Like, I think that's not hard, but I make some good ass mashed potatoes. Any. Okay. I don't help make it, but we have. Well, then you can answer that question. My grandmother's cookies. And they're great. Fantastic. They're oatmeal. They're amazing. That's I don't disgusting. even like oatmeal cookies. Neither do well, I. Well, you shouldn't. I'm they're gross. These are off the chain, though. Are you a pro present wrapper or do you feel miserably? I I can I can get, like, the paper around it, but that's a bite the long and short of it. I could win for the worst wrapper in the whole entire world, and I, I really don't care. Here's my views on wrapping presents. Okay. Sure, it's going to look nice and pretty and fancy under the tree, but... Which looks nice and fancy and pretty under But the you tree. just have to get it open. The second someone gets a hold of it, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Anymore. It's going to be in the garbage, so wasp in that. I like mine to be easy to open. That's why none of the edges meet, so you just get a finger in there, boop, rip the whole thing open. Much time. Oh my God, there's a crinkle in that. I have to fix that. This actually now. makes me want to ask you a question. Okay. Oh God, Shoot. here we so go. So this is our first Christmas together. <clears throat> do you open gifts super quickly, or do you like to like... Very slow. And be like, Very you know, slow. Talk in between each one and yep. talk about the gift... And open it slowly. We do where like one person opens and the next person opens and the next person opens and the next. We, we go round in a circle like that so it takes extra long. Or are you just like. I like that. That's good. There's another little story for you. Oh my god. At Beck. my grandmother's. Okay. I know I'm sitting shit on back but I'm the one telling stories too so I can't really do it. Open presents. My uncle hands them out and he calls out whose it is. I've got a big family. Okay. And um, 
you pretty much are left to yourself to open it. And then so it's not one at a time. Really? Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. Yeah, exactly. I'm with Amber. If we did it one at a time, each individual person, it would take years. It's so fun. Because it is yeah. so fun. But that's what the fun is. So full with presents. It almost reaches the ceiling. I think it's fun to do one at a time yeah. and really savor the moment. Christmas only happens one time a year. Yep. And it's, I agree. You know, it took so much time to find the gift, to wrap the gift, to, you know, all that anticipation. I like to make it last. Here's a little weird little question. How early do you get up on Christmas and open presents? Well, uh, when I was younger, like eight five o'clock. Now that I'm older, I mean, I don't, I, I just stay asleep until everyone else wakes up. What about you? I don't like you. Whenever I was younger, we what used to that? get up about six, seven o'clock, head over to my grandmother's house. Everybody, the whole family shows up. We have mm -hmm. like snack cakes and coffee and you know, whatever. Right. Last year I woke up. We, we, uh, do we have, like, yeah, I think we have like maybe a coffee or something like that before we do ours and I like a coffee and it's like a best, couple of biscuits or something like that. But then we go right into it. Like we don't really find it around. Because everyone else woke up, we woke up about 5 a.m., opened our gifts, and then going back to sleep. <laughs> so I never go back to sleep afterwards. Now, it's, it starts about 8, 9 o'clock. It lasts till about, you know, 10, Lunch time. Right. Then everybody goes off. You had about lunch time. For Christmas dinner. Meet the Christmas so. dinner, oh. yep. Exactly. Yeah, those traditions are so different. It's weird. Not weird. It's cool. Have you ever gone Christmas caroling? I have not. Yes, I have. <laughs> I'm not going to go sing at some random person's house. I feel house. like I would. I have, there was, like, a lot of I have. But with like my angelic voice, as you all can picture, probably beautiful, beautiful. But it wasn't like door to door, like it was like a, an event with like a group. People with me. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell. I didn't know if you were going to sing. You weren't even bell, fucking close, bro. Rock. What tops your tree? I don't really know. What goes on the top? An angel. It's usually an angel. Yeah. This isn't angel. my tree. It will be our ornaments, but it's Eric and Ricky's tree. Ornament? Do you make New Year's resolutions? Do you? you wait. It's a, okay. You showed the star though. She showed a star when she was doing her unpacking. Stick to them. I do because they're very motivating at the beginning of the year. I don't. And I sometimes stick to them and I sometimes don't. But I will be definitely making resolutions this I year. I don't do New Year's resolutions. That's a question, but whatever. I've never made really? Christmas, I mean, New Year's resolutions because the New Year thing doesn't really excite me. I'm just like, it's another day, you know? Yeah, it's New Year's really, doesn't mean much to me. I love the beginning of a New Year. It's kind of sad because, like, the holidays are gone. Of course you like it because you always start off being, well, in this year, I'm going to lose 199 pounds and then you fucking never do. But uh, seriously, at that point, like, how many New Year's resolutions do you go through of, I will, this will be my year for weight loss before you're just like, do you know what, maybe I'm just, maybe, maybe I'm not even going to bottle this year. But it's kind of like awesome because you're starting over. Everything it's, starts over. It never feels Valentine's like Valentine's Day starts over. Uh, summer starts over, even though I hate summer. Just everything completely starts over. It just doesn't feel Why do you sit there? Why? It's like fucking z z one minute past midnight. It's fucking New Year's Day. And it's like, oh, Valentine's Day. Yeah, it's only a month and a half away. Who the fuck thinks like that? I like that to me. It just feels like just one big continuous cycle. Huh. So the last question is... You that was not 20 questions. Granted, one Christmas wish, what will it be? Please, okay, can we have like an actual answer and I'll just be like, I can spend it forever with you, Beck. Um, I wish I could spend it forever with you. And if I could have an answer that isn't that, I'd be happy. For me, personally, Christmas wish, I wish Die Hard 5 never happened. <laughs> there you go. I wish Die Hard 5 never happened. Uh, what was it called? What was the fifth one called? Oh, God. What was the fifth one called? Because the fourth one was Live Free or Die Hard. Five was A Good Day to Die Hard, I think five was called. Five. Get rid of the Russian one. No one likes the Russian one. Jake Courtney. Ah, I like you. But no, you didn't work well as Bruce, Bruce Willis' son. Get out. Okay, this makes me want to cry, and I don't oh, want to cry. Fucking oh, no. God. Shit. It would just be for... um. <sighs> God, I, I wish I had a family. I wish I could spend Christmas with one family. This is meant to be fun. So, it would be for my mom, my dad, and all my three brothers. Uh, sober, happy, healthy, all under the same roof for one last Christmas together. Embarrassing. Oh, Fringe. Mean? Embarrassing. <laughs> kind of to have a Christmas that I had whenever I was younger. Oh you know, my God. mom and dad are divorced. A bunch of people are dead. Would it be? I'm going to double down on Die Hard 5. On <laughs> Die Hard 5. Not existing. Fuck me, guys. You guys can you can find any way to suck the fun out of anything. It'd be great to have just one really good Christmas with everybody there. Fantastic. That would be great. Okay. Nope. I'll, re I'll, I'll redo my... Okay. Because, you know, because they had a, an emotional emotional one. I want to join in for it. So I wish I could have a, uh, one with my whole family. All of us together. And we watch all the 
four Die Hard movies, the only four Die Hard movies that exist. We could do the quadrilogy. We could do the Die Hard marathon whilst we're having Christmas dinner. Oh, that's, that's, my, that's my Christmas wish. Now that I'm done crying, I do just want to say that Cringe. I'm grateful for Becky and I'm grateful for my for babies. And oh, actually, can I change my wish? Can I make the change my wish to wishing that Die Hard 3 and 4, which are the only two that exist after the first two, can I change both of them to actually be Christmas movies? Because number one and two are kind of Christmas movies. Number three and four, they're not Christmas movies. They didn't like that, but whatever. And I want to show you. Look. Ho, ho, ho. It's cold outside. It's cold outside. Ho, ho, ho. That's so whatever she took. Three hoes on screen right now. Yeah. She takes her poops and pees. She don't have to hurry because it's cold. Yeah. Fantastic. This is a medium. So I'm pretty good. sure she's fine. Oh, so she has fine fur. Because, like... <laughs> We couldn't find any in your size for a while. They all had just extra larges, and I'm like, that's not going to fit my little baby. Oh, I know you're Gross. too sweet. I Exciting. hope you guys really enjoyed this video. We had a lot of fun making it. We had a lot of fun making it until the end when we randomly decided to do an emotional appeal about our families being addicted to drugs and shit. You know, it was fun until fucking that happened, I guess. Jesus Christ. I, was, I wasn't expecting... That twist at the end, but I'm sticking with Die Hard. I'm just I'm Die Hard all the way, guys. Fuck, let's get on to day two of Vlogmas. Okay, guys, we're on to day two of Vlogmas. This is Dollar Tree Hall with fucking Librarian Lynn sitting here. Fucking like, why the fuck did she look like this? Like, I'm confused just about the timeline. Because in the last one, they were talking about making, like, an argument about when they should put the tree up. And they're going to meet halfway between the 1st of November and the fucking Thanksgiving. Uh, so it's like implies that this was filmed before Thanksgiving because the last video that they had was them going out to get stuff for Thanksgiving, wasn't it? I think it was. So like, when are these being filmed? Like, I thought that point of Vlogmas was you film every single day of, of like December, but obviously she just filmed like weeks in advance and are just drip feeding these out, kind of like I'm doing with these. Uh, fuck, are we? Uh, what the fuck? Why did I skip all the way to the end? Okay, never mind. Oh, I got a spoiler. They're together. One more, two, five. Let's go, guys. Well, where are you at, though? Okay. Becky shoulder again. Hi. Becky shoulder. I look really bad. Hi, Beck. You look like a ghost. Beck just looks worse with a hat on. Beck, take the hat off. Yes, I'm Casper. Is this close enough? Oh, my God. It's Please don't. Like never. No. Never. Hey, guys. Hello. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, what the fuck? Why did the, the Christmas one last at one episode? What the fuck? Why are we back to this? So we're here. No, okay, please explain to me. Why did the Christmas one go away? To do a Dollar Tree haul. Yeah. This is Becky's first haul, obviously. So. Wow, well, so exciting. Said, yeah. <laughs> that means no. <laughs> me and Beck were really, we're right on the same wavelength there. I can't believe we're back to fucking girlfriend Q and A's on hauls again already. So I got this, and this is what we're going to start wearing. But you had that on the last episode. Am I stupid? Did I do these out of order? I am going to have to check. I didn't do them out of order. This is Vlogmas Day 2. But you had that in Vlogmas Day 1. I'm... Oh my god. How the... Hi. Come on. Basic continuity. For the rest of Vlogmas. I wish we would have found them earlier. But... Yeah, but you I'm did. Here. But last time you did. <laughs> I'm so confused. Yeah. That famous laugh though. I got Santa. You had that in the last one too. These people, fuck, they're giving me a hernia. So How can you get this out of order? You're literally doing one, two, three, four. It's basic ass fucking counting. In here, but. Jesus, fuck. Okay, yeah. Well, yeah, we're you just save that and put it on Instagram. <laughs> Instagram? Yeah. We're gonna um be wearing those for some of Vlogmas, so. You already were. I'm sorry, it's so bizarre. Why? Really How can you fuck this up? This might be weird because I don't know, you know, if people's like, you know, hey, look what I, I got. I got some soap. But, you know, wow. I really like bar soap for some reason. What I does do it have smell like? Bath and uh, Body Works shower gels, but I don't know, sometimes a bar of soap. Fantastic. What does it smell like? That's all you need. That's, I feel no. like bars of soap smell. Beck, no, I can tell this is Beck's first hole. Beck didn't even tell me what it smells like. All better, too. Oh, yeah, this is lavender. Thank and you. Twilight Jasmine. Okay. I cannot wait. Yes. Thanks. And I know I'm going to be contradicting. Is Twilight Jasmine like an actual thing or is it just sounding nice? Her and I, our statement, grammar in Berlin, grammar. Got Berlin. some liquid body wash because it's not really good. Fantastic. It's Japanese bloom scented. You want to smell? Pro Fuck is Japanese bloom scented? Like Sakura? Ume? What? Probably not. <laughs> what does it smell like? I mean, it's not, it's not bad, but you know. I think it's most good. That's not Bath and Body Works. What does it so. smell like? Not even. 
This is okay. probably not going to work. You guys suck. <laughs> it was only it's, a dollar. It's an audio cable, you know, Oxford. Oh my God. And we bought one. This is genuinely the worst haul I think I've ever seen so far. It's a bar of soap, some body wash, and a fucking audio jack. <laughs> audio. I can't. Like, this is before. So. Amazing. We got a new car, which you guys know about if you watched my vlog. But you didn't show us it. Her if you watch my vlog, oh, the vlog where you said you were going to get tags for it and never once showed the fucking car. Like, <sighs> Amber's terrible. She's always been terrible and I'm depressed. Car, her one prior. You ruined my Christmas. And you couldn't really use an aux cord, so. No, you couldn't at all because, you know, it was so old. Like, yeah, Stone Ages. So now that she has a new car, aux cord it is. And I'm like an aux whore. What? You know. But this was like 2017. I'm pretty sure Bluetooth existed at that point. No, I always steal the music. I'm like, music. Yeah, I know. Like, ask anyone. And it sucks because, you know, our music tastes are different. Sometimes. Sometimes. Most like, last of night times. you were listening to old stuff, and I'm just like jamming. I imagine that she listens to whatever is currently popular, generally by female singers, and potentially The Weeknd, and Fetty Wap, whatever the fuck that person is. And I bet... Just looking at Beck, I think Beck listens to Sum 41 and Blink-182. <laughs> I don't know why. And it's solely because of the backwards half. I just think, or she listens to anime soundtracks. <laughs> Me and Beck are the same. We're both sitting there jamming out to fucking Naruto. We're sitting to listen to it. We've got a Kanabon silhouette. And then Hall Life comes on. We're like, fuck yeah. That's me and Beck. We get on. Out. I'm like, yeah. I mean, 90s, you know, like Ace of Base. And it was, it was a great share. time. Yes. What? I'm, I'm a mess of who knows what. Just so say what you like. the next thing we got is God some liquid it. hand soap for our bathroom. Oh my fucking God. We got more fucking soap. Please. It's soap, 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 audio jack, please. Because we're running out. This. I really I really hope that, because I know that these are auto-generated, because sometimes I will get auto-generated chapters and I'll put in 400 fucking chapters for individual words I say, which is bizarre but i really hope she put in hand soap <laughs> it's in very delicious and it oh really that sounds very nice do you want to smell this sure can you not even make the very nice joke come on Lauren danford what a weird name oh baby oh you're berry gonna... <laughs> uh -huh. does it smell that good i can imagine you would go to the dollar tree and wash your hands with this yeah well <laughs> dude, maybe i guess <laughs> Oh, God, Beck. God Check down. out my jar. <laughs> What's in your jar, Rebecca? <laughs> your hand. Nothing. <laughs> no, but seriously, there is nothing in this jar. There is air. No, actually. really? We bought Thanks, Amber. Thanks for explaining how fucking atmosphere works, I guess. A container of air. Oh, it's carbon monoxide. We're all going to die. <gasps> oh, thank God. <laughs> thank fuck. Oh, my God. That's the end of the time to show. We're all gone. Bye. <laughs> Who dies like that? No one dies like that. That's true. No what? one does die like that. Yeah, no one in history has ever died from carbon monoxide poisoning. Why Why would we have carbon monoxide alarms in our house if not for that? Are you going to tell them what the Fuck. jar is for? Oh. Yeah, please. It's my jar. Them. Are you going to put your soap in it? Are you going to put your soap or your audio jack in it? Which of the two? It's... Fuck. <laughs> Thanks, whichever one of the two that was. Did you hear that? I did. <laughs> my jar is for um collect collecting... Hearts, so I can go around with those stars. What? Your heart wouldn't fit here. Why? It's just so big. What? Oh. This is for, um, we're going to put topics in it and talk about them for you guys. Oh my Christ. Thank, thank God. We got some fucking tat that's in some way related to a fucking q and A. I I would have respected you more if you said it was for your fucking anime pogs. And... Whatever topics you want us to talk about, let us know in the comments and we'll None. start writing them and putting None. them in there. So the next thing I got, so I have excited. never, ever tried wait. to wear fake eyelashes before and I really want to try. I don't know if I believe you, but I this is like the earliest I've ever really seen of Amberlynn, so I don't know if that's real or not, but I just don't believe you. And these were only a dollar. Wet and wild, just like your sex life. <laughs> actually, what are you doing? Please Why do don't. you need fake eyelashes? You have eyelashes. He does. I know, but I want them to be like bigger and better so and wetter and wilder i might like try to put these on in a vlog i don't know if that would Fantastic. be a really entertaining video do you think this is a really entertaining video like really if we're like chapter eyelashes makes sense to me if we're really sitting down was the last video entertaining is this video entertaining or any of your videos really entertaining i don't know eyelash putting on a tutorials any better or any worse because i don't know i might glue my eyes shut 
Oh, oh no. God, that'd be <laughs> fucking good. I'll rush you to the hospital and be like, yeah, she was filming herself. Put this on. Okay, you guys ready? I am. Um, lipstick. Even... We're back? What is this pink lipstick for? Not being bizarre, but I just assumed Beck didn't wear makeup. For you, because I'm going to do your makeup. Oh, okay. Ah! She is planning Oh, please tell me we're not doing a girlfriend makeup challenge. Oh, is that really a girlfriend challenge? Is there so shit? Oh, I'm doing makeup. We're doing the girlfriend. No. <laughs> we're doing the girlfriend does my makeup. Oh, God. No. <laughs> The only time it's ever been acceptable was when BB did it with Chantel because BB looked like he hated his life and had no idea what the fuck he was doing. Challenge. She got to choose whatever makeup she wanted to put on me, but when Oh God, can she put on your fake eyelashes and actually glue your eyes shut? That'd be great. When I do her, I'm gonna do her makeup how I usually do my makeup. Ugh. You know, honestly, if I was gonna be serious, I would've picked better. But you I'm should've. not going to be serious about it. Oh, God. I'm gonna have fun with it. So I hope you guys are super excited for that video because I'm we will be filming that not soon. At all. And I'm a little nervous. She also has. Well, some I'm a little teapot. <laughs> Terrible. I am so not excited. I come on. I was hoping. Okay, like I I know earlier on we said about the vlog was saying I don't expect you to go out every day, but I don't expect everything to be filmed in front of this fucking weird sauna wall where you're slowly just doing girlfriend challenges or Q and A's. Some more makeup products she wants to show you that she got. I do. Got mascara. Yep. Exciting. You know, because this goes on your real eyelashes. <laughs> oh my god. I got Twiggy Star some treats. Fantastic. These are just some this is genuinely the slowest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> flavor. A lot of people, last time I got Twinkie some treats in the K9 Carryouts brand Did from the Dollar Tree. Criticize you? Not to, because the dog treats that are sold at the um, Dollar Tree aren't good for dogs, but these are actually sold everywhere. I know, right? Uh -huh. These are those aren't good for dogs. Those aren't good enough. Okay, let me tell you something. We have been giving those to dogs forever, and they're still alive. Fun. I, I don't think anyone said that they would kill the dog. It's just that they're probably not very good for the dog. Like, people have been eating McDonald's a lot, and they might not be dead yet, but, you know, it might eventually fucking take them out. Kind of an awkward argument, Beck. I realize, you know, like, you're standing up for your ramen. I get it entirely. But people saying, those are shit, you should get something better. That makes sense. Like, you know, like I said, you can feed your dog McDonald's. It probably won't kill your fucking dog, but your dog might have a lower quality of life because of it. Uh, and they're still fine. Yeah, Twinkie's a happy little baby. You guys are just extra. Fantastic. <laughs> Whoa, so am I, though. These are sold at Walmart, yep. Target, uh, PetSmart. These are sold everywhere. Wow, all, all those very reputable <laughs> brands. They're just a dollar usually everywhere you go, so that's why they also sell them at the Dollar Tree. So Fantastic. I also got this so I can uh, sweep away my sorrows. Oh, my yep. God. No, I got this for, for the litter time. because uh, if you guys have cats, you know this. Litter can sometimes travel to yes. um, said locations. Do you not have any other brush? Did you need a specific litter brush? Like, do you not have a Hoover? Unknown realms. Unknown realms. Sometimes it's, it's just, it's not like everywhere, but it's just like, you know, the vicinity of a litter box, even uh -huh. when you get a mat, there's litter and it's just super... So is this back to the point when Amber could actually reach down and touch the ground? Because I remember her looking at this recently, and I was like, there's no way you can reach down and touch the fucking ground. So delicious. Sweep it up. So that's all that's for. Oh, stunning. I don't blame you, Wasabi. It's rarity. <laughs> yeah, we got we should put big. Oh, he just ate. He's licking his chops. For counts. <laughs> Sassy plus chic. Oh my god, are we seriously just doing each individual fucking type of makeup you got? Beck, I get it. You're doing a makeup challenge. I would prefer, actually, if you didn't show... Any of this? Because, like, the fun would be if you just suddenly pulled out random shit to use on her during the challenge that she doesn't know is coming as well. That would be more fun than being, I got this for the challenge that's coming up. It's like, oh, okay, I got this to look forward to. It all looks pretty fucking basic. So it doesn't even look like it's going to be fun. Like, surely by saying, I've got a bunch of stuff here, but I'm not going to show you. Because we could be like, oh, is it going to be silly? Is it going to be clown makeup? Is it going to be crazy? But you're showing, I got basic foundation. It's like, oh. Oh, okay, so I, I, I suspect that it's just going to be, like, a normal makeup. Yeah, it's not going to be, like, anything weird or crazy then. Foundation. You're going to put that on my face? Mm-hmm. Okay, Probably. I'll be honest. She, at first, chose a darker one, and I was like, girl, I am pasty white. <laughs> not really. <laughs> You're not really object. pasty. My last object. My last object. Okay, this is... Is it uh, more makeup? Eyeshadow. And <sighs> Heck. Please, this is the one situation where I would... A lightly request to be blue balled. I personally would not have chose these back in the for, back in the day for Fantastic. myself. Fantastic. Okay. Because you know you... I was into like either really dark colors or really neon colors. I imagine you would be an emo. Why for me then? Because why not? So the last thing I got, I really like puzzles. This one doesn't, but maybe, yeah. 
rarity but I'm maybe rarity. we can do it together it's only 300 pieces that's nothing yeah. but look how freaking cute it looks oh like shit larger pieces <laughs> this is like a children's one isn't it if it's larger pieces plus grande pieces if it's larger pieces like this is like a children's one this is like baby's first fucking puzzle you are unamazed but please look at this oh my god this is <laughs> great there you go back <laughs> Sell it. I wish this Sell was it my for car. me. It's a Don't vlog. You? Can no. you imagine me driving that? I mean, that's like a little. I can imagine you driving because that would require you to actually have some agency in your own life. So no, I couldn't imagine you driving that. Wagon, but you know, that's adorbs. Adorbs. Oh my god. <laughs> Adorable. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Literally didn't at all. Baby. Baby. Seriously. Seriously. Baby. Baby. Wow. Baby. Baby. Okay. Yeah. This is... Why are you making me? Baby? Oh my god, they are so cute together. This is definitely such a endearing relationship and not actually fucking irritating. Mimic! Mimic! <laughs> Kate wants what sucks. Kate wants what sucks. Oh my Mimic. god, I cray cray. I and didn't. we will see you in the next one. Bye! Bye. What was the rule? Did you have to be over nine minutes this time for the fucking middle rollouts? Why did we just get that random pointless shit? Uh, God, that was really point. Especially just like the makeup. Like I said, I'd rather be blue balled. I'd rather say, I've got some makeup here and just hold up a bag and give me a really rustle or something like that. Like, I, I do enjoy someone rustling my bag occasionally like that. But just say, like, I've got this. This is going to be for the future challenge. And it's like, oh, I wonder what might be in it. You show me everything you're going to use. And it's like, oh. Oh, okay. I guess you're just going to do general makeup then uh okay straight on to vlogmas day three or which will be filmed in november 1st probably okay we're back with what's in my mouth challenge another another girlfriend challenge i'm so excited fucking beck sitting here looking iconic being leonardo the fucking best of the turtles he is the best of the turtles because he has two swords and swords are cool i don't think they're katanas but I don't remember what the ninja swords are called. Ninjakas? Ninjakas? Something like that? Ninja swords. They're pretty cool. Way cooler than Raph with his fucking sigh. Who wanted to be Raph? No one wanted to be Donatello either. What, did he have a stick? <laughs> what, are, what is the other one called? Fuck. Michelangelo, Donatello, Raphael. Oh my god. What the fuck was the other one called? There's another one and he had nunchucks. Oh my Christ. Oh God, I can't actually remember that. I actually feel really bad. I'm, not, I'm just kind of dragging out this video. He'll probably don't care about the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I don't. They were fucking before my time, so I didn't really watch them. But I remember there being four. Donatello, Michelangelo, Raphael. Oh my God. I'm thinking back to the epic rap battles <laughs> where, the, where the actual painters argued against the actual turtles. Fantastic. Watch it if you haven't watched it. Ugh. Oh. I'm not going to lie when I say I actually zoned out and stared blankly at the screen for a full minute there. Trying to remember what the fucking last turtle was called. And I do not remember. Because there was one, he was the party dude, and he liked pizza. I think all of them liked pizza. But I don't remember what his name was. And I, fuck, I'm not even going to look it up. I'm going to live with my shame. You best not have got some nasty stuff. I didn't. I wouldn't do that to you. Oh. Yeah, I didn't bring a blindfold. We could use one of your oh, hats. No. Do you want to put it in my mouth first or do you want me to put it in your mouth first? <laughs> Ugh, gross. <laughs> I don't think about the turtles again. Um, I wanna put it in your mouth first. Okay. Oh. Hey guys! Oh, we're back to we're back to Christmas songs again now. Why do you have a blurry ass picture? Could you not get a picture of Beck holding still? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, beautiful. Jingle bell, jingle bell. So in this video, I'm not gonna lie. The whole the whole time during that opening song, I have still been trying to think of what the other turtles called. So we are doing that oh, "What's in My Mouth" challenge, and okay. I'm low key nervous because when you don't know what's going in your mouth, you don't know what's going in your mouth. Like fantastic, oh, I have this weird thing with like I actually don't know what this challenge is. Is it okay? So does like Amber blindfold herself and back put something in Amber's mouth? Is that what it is? Because if not, I'd just be confused with the whole thing in general. Gross stuff. Oh, is this going to be weird and sexual? Like, most of my videos somehow turn out to be weird and sexual. I don't want to think of this. So, she chose five items to put in my mouth Fantastic. when I can't see, and I chose five items to put in her mouth when she okay, can't so see. Okay, so thanks for explaining. So are you ready to, to do this? No, let's do it. You better not have got something to say. I really hope one of them is the fourth Ninja Turtle. <laughs> the one with the nunchucks. I really hope it's the fourth one's a Ninja Turtle with the nunchucks, so I know who the fuck you're talking about. Absolutely, that I absolutely hate Emberlyn. I will be so mad. 
You don't know oh, how bad. Wait, okay. what, are, what am I doing? Can I, I just tie this? Actually, like no. Okay. Jesus fucking <laughs> Christ. <laughs> you know what? She looks like a fucking. <laughs> she looks like a cow with a feed bag on her, which I guess is just really fitting. <laughs> oh my god. I gotta be able to get to her. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> what? There. Oh my okay. god. Oh my god, I can't breathe. I don't want to hear it. Okay. What the fuck is that? Leaf oregano? 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 I I can tell it's a jar. Okay, fantastic. Maybe. I think. <laughs> Do the cinnamon challenge. <laughs> Could you not have thought of any better way to do that than to just kind of chuck it on her tits? Oops. Fantastic. Thanks for that. <laughs> okay. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Baby! Yeah. No, you're cheating. Babe! <laughs> no. Oh. Are we going to get a bet at any okay. point? I mean, I knew exactly what that was. That's it. That's that basil stuff. Well, basil stuff? Basil? Paisley? Paisley? Parsley. Italian. No. It's Italian. Oh, yeah, fucking. You just took a whole lasagna in your mouth. What is it? It's oregano. Oh, my God. Thanks. That was gross. Basil Italian. Gonna put a sweet and salty nut right in her mouth. That one's really <laughs> like his jingling, like candy, so. Jingle Wait, bells. that's not jingles. Jingling. Wait. I do know what? I'm gonna have to fucking look up this turtle. I have spent the entire. I'm not gonna lie. Anytime I've fallen silent during this entire reaction, I have been thinking, what the fuck is the name of the fourth turtle? I'm gonna have to look. It's fucking Donatello. Fuck's sake. <laughs> that sounds like candy. Uh, Only a fat girl, right? Yep. Good. I'm so scared after what you just did to me. Okay, there we go. Fantastic. I was really hoping, like, it was going to be like, I know, I'm like, I'm not sounding weird. Objects and shit like that, not just like, here's some fucking oregano, here's a fucking peanut protein bar. I was hoping it'd be like something, like, put that lamp in. Maybe put the plastic of that lamp in and tell it to bite down. And pull it really quickly so someone actually takes the fucking plastic off that lamp. I'm never gonna let that die, die down until that's fucking fixed. <laughs> Where's that sweet and salty thing? Legitly, why are you even blindfolding her? She could just fucking close her eyes. It's like once it's in her mouth, she can't fucking see it. Take the work. Yep. <laughs> okay. Chew that up. I'm I don't even know what she system. said. No, it ain't. Oh my that's god. That's a fuck off. Don't pretend you don't like it. Oh, those are so good. But we just had dinner. Yeah, you're right. Did you? <laughs> Fucking Amber right here. Being, oh, I don't want to eat. I just had dinner. Okay, Amber. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? It blew in my eyeball. What? Oh, my Something God. Something just blew in my eye. I mean, I know you, you know, this or that. Has anyone ever accused... <sighs> Fucking hell. Has anyone ever accused Amber of being overdramatic? I, w I wouldn't think so. I asked it earlier, but... <laughs> this, I don't want you to eat. I just want to put it in your mouth and you figure out what it is. Okay, fantastic. What? Are you ready? Wait, <laughs> Wait I have to like suck on it? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Oh God, just, good. just tell her to close her eyes. This is fucking silly. What is it? A oh. pinto bean. Okay. Oh my God, it's not what I think it is, is it? What? Oh my God, is it that frozen chicken? No. <laughs> Why would I do that? Why would they just put a chicken in your mouth? Okay. <laughs> just do Oh my God. <laughs> you guys like specific. Look, fucking back looks mental. Holy shit. You guys, like, planned the shit out. Could you not have found, like, a, a long sock or something like that to use as a blindfold? For fuck's sake. <laughs> what the? What the? Wait. We just needed a blindfold. <laughs> Are any of them going to make a joke at any point if I, I put my bean in your mouth? Are any, is anyone going to make that joke? Or am I going to have to step up for all of these? Salt. <laughs> it was so depressing. Uh, Ew! <laughs> oh my god, this Kidney is beans. Pinto beans. Pinto. You're so boring. Why do the girlfriend challenges suck so much? Ramen noodle soup. Okay. I she's just gonna sense it. She probably smells it from there. This woman's addicted to ramen. This better be good. My mouth tastes funky. I didn't think this was all going to be food related. I thought it was going to be... Jesus fucking... This aggression. <laughs> Give it a chew. Come on, lady. Okay. Oh, just... my God. Ew! 
My God. It's, she hasn't made like a single guess without looking at the fucking packet this first. This is Robin Nibbles, Ricky. He's that like... I'm supposed business. to be guessing. Yeah, you're supposed... Like so yeah, you're supposed to be guessing. Stop taking your blindfold off and looking at what it is first. Of course, I can't guess. It, it, like the grossness like stops your... Gross. None of this... Or... You're stupid. <laughs> what a two. Uh, the grossness interferes with your synapses or you're fucking stupid. This is gross. Oh, mm -hmm. I'm scared mm -hmm, what the mm -hmm. fuck you're giving me. Okay. It's probably disgusting. All right, is this the grand finale? Chlamydia. <laughs> Chlamydia. There you go. That's probably what she gave you. I told you that. No mayonnaise. It better not be. Yeah. Yeah. What are you laughing about? Nothing. Ooh, that sounds like chips. Oh. Uh, I, bro, I... Are you ready? I I'm barely right. even you get a ready. chance to look you at them. Brace. You better brace I think it's yourself. a crouton. It's a crouton, bro. Yeah, it's a crouton. crouton! There you go, finally. Mm. Mm. Oh, I do you know what? Like, I've always said, because Beck is uncreative, because it's like when they were doing the, the baby food thing, Beck was just like, what's my favorite color? That, like, level of shit, because, I don't know, Beck is a bit uncreative, like... But I really want Amber, who just looks confused as fuck here. I want Amber to stick that fucking photo in her fucking mouth or something like that. Something a little bit interesting. Mm, not good. All right. Okay. Oh, God. Go on. I have one. Oh, yeah. Right. I'm having <laughs> Look at me. There you go. See? Oh, yeah. <laughs> See? Stupid. Oh, she doesn't look man. stupid. She looks great. So scared. She's just about to go out there and rob a 7-Eleven. <laughs> They're going to be really confused. They're going to say it was the blue turtle. Thank God it wasn't the purple one. Donna something. We don't know the name of that one. I still can't believe it. it took me that fucking long and I had to look at it on Wikipedia. And Wikipedia could be wrong. I don't know. Could we talk about a fucking goblin? <laughs> right now. I'm going to start off. For anyone who just watches Amberlynn thing, don't ask. Not the worst. There you go. Really Let's go. The worst. Yeah, there's an order. Put a ring in there. I have a zip as I... Garlic powder. If she's had your cooking, she knows what garlic powder fucking tastes like. Super disgusting. Yep, there we go. You please, spat it out. Please tell me that you put it on a spoon or something like that to put it in her mouth and you don't just fucking chuck a handful of it at her face. Oh, uh, I mean, what do you mean? Where the fuck am I spitting it out to? We'll oh. figure it out. Is it a lot? Nah. Is it a lot? I really That's... didn't put a lot. Because I... Wow, fucking Amber actually does plan ahead. Thank God. I, I, I don't know if this is safe. <laughs> it's safe. You're fine. <laughs> You're fine. You <laughs> oh my god, set the camera further back. You're gonna give me a fucking aneurysm if you keep moving that. Oh, no, uh, oh my god, here. back over your I'm fucking mouth. Take it in your mouth. There you go. She barely even took any of it. Wait, the lighting. The lighting is bad. Wait, the lid, but what the fuck was your voice? <laughs> god, <laughs> Baby, are you there okay? you go. Yep. She got you it right. Okay? Oh my god. We're back. Oh, the suffer. So that was literally like <laughs> the worst. Yeah, I was going to say, you probably should have like, some water on hand. Oh, water worse. Butter, but, what the? Butter flavor syrup. Okay. Butter flavor syrup. Why don't you just use butter? Why are Americans weird? Just use butter. Butter melts. What do you mean? Artificially flavored. With what? <laughs> what art? Just use butter. Why do you need artificially flavored something to taste like butter? Just use butter. I need one of the worst. You guys are I'm weird. What? What the fuck? I've never liked this stuff no, very much. No, you're making that sound. <laughs> if Amber doesn't like it, it must be fucking rotten. Baby, it's good. It's good. It's good. You'll like it. You'll actually like this. Oh my God, Beck. Yeah. Not up. Did she even get any of it? <laughs> what? Ew. Oh Did my God. Even get <laughs> any of it? What is that? <laughs> I don't know why this is so. Why would you oh like your tongue with the tissue? It's me. gross. What is it? That tastes so fucking <laughs> weird. Are you gonna guess? <laughs> that is that garlic. Oh, oh my god! It's, it's like garlic. That's sticky. I have to do laundry anyways. Jesus Christ. This is, I feel like I'm playing like. What the fuck is that? I don't even know what the fuck this is. It's just a red thing. Spuck. What the fuck? Snack pack. Okay, that doesn't even fucking help me. What does it taste like? It's. Does it taste like red? Double dog dare or something. Why don't you actually. <laughs> Because Beck was so adamant about it in the fucking last haul, why don't you give her one of those fucking dog treats and make her eat and see how good she feels after that? Right. Like, you know, remember suicide drinks? Oh God, Here, wait a minute. Just... How'd you know I was coming? Yeah, I was about to say, how the fuck does she know you're coming if you're blindfolded? Ah, uh, Beck, you're cheating! Coming? You see uh -huh. it? No, because you yeah. said, Here, baby. Beck knew. Beck knew what? you're <laughs> cheating. <laughs> I'm scared. Open oh, your no, fucking mouth. Yeah, I love this. This one tastes good. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> the body language changed. She liked that. Jello? <laughs> yeah!
fucking. <laughs> I can't get past just looking at her like this. That took so long. I'm just making sure. Okay, you are winning. You're gonna well, win this whole game because you're doing. Well, yeah, because you never even tried to guess. You never once tried to guess. Isn't it right? You know what I'm saying? You actually cheated and took your blindfold off. Yeah, every, time. every single the time. It was the garlic. But all I'm saying, well, you cheated constantly because you knew that thing was coming. You're definitely looking. Europe. <laughs> what the fuck is this? It's a strawberry lemonade mix. You guys suck. Why isn't it baby food or something like that again? Why isn't it something weird? A melee garlic powder was kind of weird. But you should end with the weird thing. You shouldn't start with the weird that? thing. I'm not sure. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Are we getting... Really? Are we really having to watch the full pouring? There you go. There you go. That's plenty. I remember when I was young, I used to eat Lucasade powder with a spoon. <laughs> so so I, I relate to this. It was pretty nice. Okay, okay. go on. There you go. Wait, you probably got it! You didn't even get any. There's no white on her tongue. I love it. Ooh, I've good. said that before. Oh, you want some more? Wait, no. I know what that is. That's my country, Tom's lemonade. That's your lemonade powder. You want some more? No, okay. That almost kind of tastes not. like fun dip. <laughs> fun dip? Yeah. What the fuck's fun dip? I like that one. I don't know. I feel like yours were meaner. Meaner? I don't even I remember. I wouldn't put that shit in. I don't even remember what hers were because they were so fucking boring. Oh, no. The grand finale. No, that what garlic one, though. Mexican mud slide? What the fuck is a Mexican mud slide made with rum? Okay. So it's a cocktail. Extreme. That's quite nice. It looks a bit what was that? sickly. Uh -huh. It looks like that's definitely yeah. like an end of the night you're going to throw up kind of drink. <laughs> Wait, don't laugh. Hold on. I have to take some of this because it's about to spill. Is that ready? Well, it implies okay, it's quite nice. That. Why don't you oh, just like get a cup? There you go, back. Back. Why? Oh, oh, mm -hmm. oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. No, maybe, okay. maybe. That is, uh... Holy actual fuck. <laughs> I, was, I just wish it was something fun. Like like the garlic powder. Fine. That's the kind of shit you should be going for. But every, it's like, do you want a cocktail? Do you want a jello pop? You know, it's just like, bro, fucking, I don't know. The fucking, do you want to try one of my old town pots? I don't fucking know. Literally anything would be more interesting than this. The mudslide. Yep. Okay. Yay! Fantastic. She won every single one. I didn't guess the syrup one. Oh. Yeah, she didn't get the butter. You did way better than I did. Congratulations for being awesome. Oh my awesome. god. Now we have like a horrible mess to clean up. God, I just remembered they had the fucking girlfriend makeup challenge thing coming up as well. I was really hoping we're done with the girlfriend shit and we could do some actually fun stuff. But this shit, come on, guys. It's my fault, so. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. I'm oh, sorry that they weren't cat. disgusting, but I'm a wuss. <laughs> there were some of them were gross. But okay. yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed and we'll see you the next one. I don't know if I enjoyed it better than the last one because, like, I don't remember what the last one was. And I am, I'm going to be really honest with you guys. The reason I don't remember what the last one was is I spent, like, the majority of the start of this video trying to remember what Donatello's name was. I, that is not even a lie. I spent, I think, it must have been a good five minutes trying to think what the fuck Donatello was called. But that's going to be it, guys. Oh, uh, Random Vlogmas has not been a great start. I like the first one with the Christmas questions. Those are fun. Until fucking the last question, they decided to ruin it by randomly being emotional. But, like, the girlfriend challenge stuff is a bit weak sauce. I want to get back to doing some, like, fun stuff. Out, not even out of the house. Just doing anything than sitting here doing these, like, the fun challenges thing. Because they're all kind of lame and a bit old school. But that's going to be it, guys. Have a good one. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.